Hi, my name is Gabrielle Macomb. Uh, I'm 22 years old. I'm a black belt to Ana Leticia Ribeiro on Grace Maita. I'm gonna speak for myself. Uh, I, I trained since I was a little kid, so for me, that was my fun part of, of the day. Besides school, like uh, that was my work, go to school. But beside that, go to the gym was my, the best part of my day. That they changed my child, like my, my life in childhood. And for a woman, it's, it's about like uh, self-defense. Uh, sometimes you go to work and you're stressful and you have to unstress. You go to the gym, you talk to your friends, you make a lot of friends at the gym, so they're always there for you. It's like Leticia always say that they, we, is not, we are not just a trained partner, we are like psychologists too. Sometimes they need to talk, just, we're not gonna resolve their problem, but just by talking, they kind of feel better. So it's kind of like that, I think. Helps a lot, and a lot of things, but this is one big way that helps people, for women especially. Uh, it's kind of like, uh, I'm gonna give an example, after I go back to the term. It's like, uh, if the gene doesn't have a woman's class, or if it doesn't have a lot of women's, the women don't really look for, and they go to the gym, they only see men, they're gonna say like, ah, I don't wanna try because they only have men there. And I don't, or some parents go there, take their kids, that they're girls, and say, no, I don't wanna my kids train up because just have boys. So they have this preservation like that. So sometimes the women don't compete because they think like, oh, it's very aggressive, or it's a, it's a sport for men or something like that, you know, like, or parents don't put their kids to compete because they think it's aggressive, but if they see, a term for just for girls, they're gonna see, oh, it's something different, you know, like uh, they have it, their their girls thing, you know, like uh, they, they're not just for boys, they see a different way of jujitsu, you know, and they see that we have a big community, so they're not gonna be scared of putting their, their self there to compete, if they just see for girls. I think first, they have to train up for a little while, I'm not gonna say like, uh, you just start for a month and then you go there compete, I think they have to train for a while, especially because they are beginners. And go watch tournaments before you go, because sometimes they never even watch one tournament and they put themselves there. And as soon as they get there, they freak out. <laughs> so it's better to have a notion of what they are doing, what they are gonna put themselves to. And the first tournament, I think you just have to go to test yourself and have fun. And if you really wanna be a professional thing, you know, like and be. Choose that for your whole life, child. Oh, I want to compete all the time because it, not because I want to win, it's because I want to have fun all the time. I, I appreciate that. So go, you know, like uh, compete. But I was training. Don't just go without training. Go there for enough because it, uh, those ways you're gonna get hurt. So I was train uh, and then you go there compete if you like to compete. Too. Some people don't even go to compete because they like just to train. So that's okay too. But I think for the people that you want to try to compete for the first time or something like that, uh, it's better you train first, get ready, prepare yourself, and go. Don't just go to have fun without training, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's because if they see just the jiu for girls and they go there and they try themselves, they're going to feel special. Especially because, like example, right now, we don't have a term just for guys. It's just for boys. So they're gonna say, oh, it's just for girls, so just girls. Sometimes they, people have that like a girl power thing, so they're gonna feel like special that, they, oh, we, we have a term just for us, so that's cool, you know? It's kind of like that, I think, they, what some women think. And some women think the privilege of growing jiu-jitsu, that they, okay, that's cool that we have a term for girls, that's gonna att uh, attract more girls to the jiu-jitsu community, they're gonna like more. So people get happy about that. And it's good that they come from guys, coming from guys that is taking this opportunity to do it, you know. Like I, for, for you guys that you're guys starting this tournament, that's a good thing for the girls. Like it's not just, a, usually when I have something for girls, it's always a woman that start. But if the idea comes from a guy that, he, oh, we're gonna do this for the women, that's a, pretty cool for the girls.